Okay, this is my review of this Isanox LX New Clinical Booster. Um, this one is the Moisture Lock. And if you remember from my last video that this was in that box of items with my starter kit. Um, so this is this line has, I don't know, this thing, I guess it's not really line. The line is this up here. And then this booster stuff is one of three that they have. Um, so obviously the one I had is the moisture lock over there on the right, but they also have a microbiome, ba microbiome balance and a pore perfector. So this says, small but mighty, this super light skincare powerhouse has a high concentration of a single ingredient or two to target specific concerns. And so I think that is what all this mumbo jumbo at the bottom is all these letters and percentages wise. Um, so this does come from a Korean company under Avon cause that's who bought them out. Um, so that's how you don't see a lot of this stuff here, but that's what it says on the side. And then it did come sealed with this and then it came with that dropper, which I guess now that the dropper's in there, do I just throw this away? Cause I'm gonna. Um, so a highly concentrated booster. The NMF is natural moisturizing factor. Um, I don't think anything else is exciting in there. So this is what I learned. So this falls under the category of serums, which before this journey of learning about anything, everything, I was like, I don't know what a serum is supposed to be. So serum, I guess, means anything that you put on your face in between washing it and moisturizing it. That's supposed to do something. So you can have like an eye serum or a face serum or whatever. So this falls under that category of stuff to do to your face. So after learning that, I was still kind of like, mm, okay. So I tried it. And this calls for you to put a couple drops on your face. Um, in the morning and nighttime. This is really cool. So I like this thing. First of all, the bottle, if you can hear it, it's not like a plastic, like a shampoo bottle plastic, which is what I was expecting. This is like something hard, like aluminum maybe? I don't know what it is. And then this dropper is really nice feeling. So packaging wise, yes, this feels pretty high end. Um, and then pretty much same directions on the back. Made in Korea, of course. Um, I have nothing against Korea. It's just like United States, too. Okay, I can't open this. Hold on. So I'm going to open it and show you kind of what it's like. So I've been using it for a few days now. Okay, how can I do this? Hold on. Okay, this is what it looks like in the dropper. And this is what it looks like a drop on my skin. So... It's not super thick, um, it's not greasy feeling, it's just nice and light, and I bet I can't rub it in, yes I can, okay. Um, you rub it in and it's very smooth. So I put it on, and here's the part where it started to turn, because going into this I was like, okay, well I don't use any serum type of stuff, I don't know what the point of all these things are. So I put this on. And it like glides over my face. And I don't know how to describe it, but when they say moisture lock, that's kind of what I felt like it actually did. So it, it went in pretty nicely. And then I felt like I didn't need to use a moisturizer. I did, but I've been using it and it makes your skin like, I don't know, feel good. <laughs> I like it and I guess that's enough for me. I don't specifically care exactly what's in it or exact ingredients or exactly what it does, but it feels good and I like it. Um, and then I was like, well, this is, you know, nice, but this is probably very expensive, you know, thinking of the packaging and how nice it feels on my skin. I was like, this has got to be like 50, 75 buck thing. 
No, it's not. I was shocked to see that this was a $23 thing. I mean, it's, it's smaller. It says one ounce in the bottle. But for how I, high end it feels, yeah, I'm impressed. So that is what I've used so far. Um, I have other stuff I want to use, but I kind of want to get through some of the stuff I already have. Like there's that one that's like um, a polishing one, but I have something, I don't know if I can throw it over here. I have this system from doTERRA that I'm trying to get through yet before I start something new because I just don't want a whole ton of stuff. I have a face wash that I'm using before I want to use the face stuff. So I kind of want to use those up. So those are going to, those reviews are going to be a little bit later on. Um, so yes, that is my review. I like it. It feels good on my face. I would repurchase with my money, own money. Um, so that's all.